we start with breaking news out of Richmond this morning where police are investigating two shootings that happened earlier this morning. And one of those shootings resulted in life threatening injuries. Brendan King joins us live with what we know right now from police and crime insider sources. Brendan. And those crime insider sources tell us victims are both females in both of these shootings earlier this morning, Reba and Janine. And I'm also learning that these shootings happen within a mile of each other, both in the city's east end. So let's first start our video south of Interstate 64. Just moments ago, Richmond police, they confirmed that one of the shootings happened near the intersection of Fairfield Avenue and McCanksville Turnpike. Detectives tell us that one of these victims in this in this case is suffering life threatening injuries. And the shooting call came in just before 1230 this morning. And then police received another call for a shooting about an hour later and a half mile down Fairfield Avenue in Fairfield Court. We're told this shooting happened on Newborn and North 23rd Streets. The victim in this case is expected to survive. And as we continue to ask police questions about what happened, what led up to the shooting, if they have any suspect description to pass along, they're always encouraging our viewers to reach out to police if they can to help solve these cases. And Janine and Reba, the crimes come just hours after Richmond police officers and their leaders gather with the community across the city for National Night Out and our Elizabeth Holmes. She'll pick up that side of our coverage in just a few minutes. All right, Brendan King reporting live. Thanks, Brendan. For the third time in four months, former